thing um i just thought i'd quickly bob on here to remind you that with this uh hot weather and everything um our faces get really dry um as you know and yes we do add a lot of products on to keep it moist and creams and serums um but also it's very good for your face to have a good scrub so that the actual um, goodness of all those serums that we use actually get soaked in um, so when it's really dry like this or when I'm abroad I tend to do facial scrubs as well um, I do them in the morning because then uh, my beauty products can go in on a nice clean face basically um, I also need to remind you don't forget your lips I mean uh, I don't know about you but mine get really dry um, probably because I don't drink enough water um, but uh, I don't know if you can still buy it but I used to buy a lot of Jamboree products um, which is where my nails are from um, and I bought this um, with the lip uh, stains liquid lip stains uh, it's called Jam Beauty but it's a scrub for your lips it's a sugar lip scrub um, which is great because it gets away all those uh, dry patches that you get and everything so that lipsticks and lip stains especially can glide on and actually stay nice and look nice um, so I also use a lip scrub when I'm doing the face scrub um, and I've just come back from a spa at the Belfry and they use a spa products and I loved their uh, face facial exfoliator and mask um, which I've just used it's lovely you apply it on a damp face in circular movements until the beads sort of have soaked in um, so they're not bad for the environment um, and then you rinse off and then you just leave before you add any other products um, it smells gorgeous um, it smells like you're in a spa again which is nice uh, nice thought nice feeling um, but I just thought I'd quickly bow on to remind you of that and I may do depending on how I feel I think my face is feeling okay actually after that scrub um, but I also use the sand and sky brilliant skin detoxifying and brighten um, which came with its own little brush which I love um, and it actually goes on pink um, but dries slightly lighter pink but um, that too also really good for my face um, for, for days after I, I had used it I could feel all my products going into my skin a lot easier a lot better um, and just took away all the impurities and and it says what it does I think it detoxifies your face and your skin um, which is good um, all right hope you all have a good day and I'm going to get changed now hi people I just thought I'd quickly bob on here because I had a parcel delivery today and I wanted to share it with you because <clears throat> we all love a good parcel um, so I received this today lovely package they even put the box in it's from Liberty <laughs> they even put the bag in for me that's really sweet um, but more importantly is what's in the box and it is a gorgeous birthday present to me from me <laughs> uh, from Herm Herm Studios um, H E R M. I just saw it and fell in love with it and thought I think it's time I had a new one. Yep, it's a new watch. How gorgeous is that? Rose gold on a black watch strap. Um, and it is five, I think it's five atmospheric um, pressure waterproof as well uh, which is great because I, I really needed a waterproof watch whilst I've enjoyed wearing my Fitbit um, I just find that it's such a pain because I've got to take it off every time I shower or any time I'm near water um, which is quite often when you've got a lot of dogs as well um, so I figured maybe it's time that I actually changed up um, 
as I'm not monitoring my fitness levels much these days simply because I'm just trying to function and get around due to my Sjogren's flaring up at the moment um, all my limbs and even my hands are stiff um, that's hurting just to <laughs> go in a fist um, so yeah so I decided to treat myself this month um, to an early birthday present um, which I thought was appropriate and I absolutely love um, this watch it's just simple sleek I love the style of it scratch resistant um, as well so I don't know what else to say about it really um, uh, that's not focusing either <laughs> no good at this um, but yeah it it is really gorgeous um, a simple style and sleek design that I thought would look really nice on my wrist yes how nice is that and I think it'll go with most things as well um, so I'm very pleased with it i would never heard of the brand Herm before um, but uh, Liberty are currently selling them and if you are a new customer and you sign on um, they will give you a 10% code for joining their newsletters um, so it's worth it really um, and literally it's almost next day delivery <laughs> unbelievable um, but yeah it's a uh, Rhonda uh, glass is scratch resistant crystal sapphire uh, rose gold um, and the strap is handmade suede leather strap so beautiful beautiful watch and that's it really thanks i hope you're doing well in this hot weather see you soon bye morning guys uh today i thought i would try um some hair conditioning stuff um and i've been putting off trying this one because it seems such a faff Especially in this day and age where a lot of people, parents and everybody who are short on time really, um, you know, you just don't have time to look after yourself these days. You want something that's quick and easy that you can use whilst you're doing your other things, I guess. Um, but anyway, I got this in one of my birch boxes, uh, Philippa Kingsley Elasticizer Coconut Breeze. Now, whilst it smells okay it smells uh, quite good it's a bit of a faff so far as you can see i've got my hair cap on um basically you've got to wet your hair add this on um put your little shower cap on um and then leave it on for around 20 minutes is recommended so i'm timing it to see um, to put it on, leave it for 20 minutes and see the difference in my hair whether it's really worth that extra hassle of having to wet your hair before you've even jumped into the shower um, leaving it on for 20 minutes yes you can go around doing other things but boy you look a bit stupid um, and if you've got kids they will laugh at you um, anyway I will get back to you after I have done this um, if it's any good, obviously, I will let you know. But I have currently been using this Josh Wood Radiant Shine hair treatment oil. I love the smell of it. It leaves my hair gorgeous and manageable. Um, just salon finished almost. Um, all I do is put a couple of these pipettes, because it's in a little pipette thing, that um so it's measured out i used a couple of those in my hands just put i put one on and then put it in put another one on and make sure i've caught the ends and everything um a little goes a long way i've had this for a while and just about getting halfway through the bottle um and basically it smells divine um again you just bung it on I put it on while um, just before I sit down to watch something on telly uh, on an evening um, I just put it on early on 
uh, leave it. I don't even have to put a shower cap on or anything. No wetting, nothing. Um, I bung it on um, and leave it for as long as you want or as long as you can. Um, and then once I've watched something or had my dinner or whatever, I jump into the shower and wash it all out. Pretty simple, I think. <laughs> Pretty easy um, for busy working people of, of today. Um, so yeah, I would definitely recommend this, Josh Wood. Um, and it's sold at Marks and Spencers. So anyway, we shall see how this Philippa Kingsley one goes in comparison and how it leaves my hair. Um, I just hope it's worth a hassle because I can't see me doing this often. Um, you know, wetting your hair beforehand, putting the product in, leaving it on and then washing it out like that. Um, I don't know. Thoughts anybody, please let me know. Um, I'm still in my nighty because I wanted to do this before I jumped into the shower. Catch you later. Bye. Hi everybody. Um, now I did my hair and I must say, yes, it's a lot softer. Um, having used that uh, Philip Kingsley um, elasticizer coconut breeze um, yeah I, I I would say it actually worked um, but then you need to be the judge of whether it's worth the hassle of what I explained which is wetting your hair putting it on shower cap leaving it on um, it's probably an intensive treatment I'm intrigued to see how long it lasts for um, this sort of feeling of yeah it's really soft actually um but we'll see we'll see i might be able to update you later although it's a bit wayward at the moment um because it still needs styling but i can't be bothered because it's so hot at the moment and i hope you're all taking care during this heat keep hydrated and don't forget to use your spritzers on your face as well because that needs hydrating as well um and i I either use the Dragon's Blood one um, by Rodile, um, Hy Hyaluronic Tonic, probably not how you pronounce it, um, and the 8 Hour Miracle Hydrating Mist. This one's brilliant, you can put it over makeup and just spritz it on and it makes you feel a bit more refreshed and cool. Um, but I'm just trying out that Rodile because normally I just use Elizabeth Arden. Um, but anyway, guess what guys? It's Birch box day I can't believe it's come round again already um, but yeah it is it has and I can't wait to go and unbox for you guys so see you in a minute hey I'm back again um, like I said my birch box has arrived yay um, I always love birch box day because it feels like my birthday every time and actually is my birthday month this month so hurrah for me um, can't wait um, to see what's inside this box because it always give you some good products oh, I love the colour of it as well I'm such a pink girl how beautiful is that mm. I prefer the ones that um, you can pull out like drawers um, those are my preference but uh, this is still beautiful anyway thanks Birchbox um right let me see oh my days <laughs> i've only just gone and ordered this because i've heard such rave reviews of this the balance me congested serum um you can put it on pre if you feel like spots are going to come out or you're going to break out um you can put it on beforehand um and it's um apparently really really good um 99 natural so i just went and ordered one to try it out myself um although i don't have any breakouts at the moment you do tend to get some during summer because you're putting on a lot of probably moisture and oily stuff um on your skin and the areas that actually don't need it um tend to get over clogged um, in your pores really and um, you you wouldn't be able to know that because there are patches where we'll need it more than others and um, there's no way you can tell 
so it happens guys it happens so this is the balance me congested serum even the most diligent skincare routine can't always prevent a breakout fortunately whether it's one pimple or a blemish battlefield this soothing serum works to balance skin and refine pores smooth on a thin layer before your moisture or dab directly into blemishes as a spot treatment excellent thank you birchbox need that um now i've got the chlorine floral water makeup remover this looks so cute <laughs> perfect for travel uh removes makeup in one step with its clever miracle micellar water it contains soothing cornflour gently removing face eye and lip makeup simply soak a cotton pad and then sweep it across your face there's no need to rinse and there's definitely no excuse for sleeping in your makeup now so um i don't know about you guys but it's really bad to try to leave your makeup on and sleep in it uh when i was younger yeah i do it some sometimes but nowadays i don't simply because i don't really want my pillows to be mucked up anyway either um at the moment i'm really suffering with my sjogren's um i'm finding it hard to grip um my items they're very weak on my hands at the moment um so I can't even open this to smell it at the moment. Um, my son is the one that has been supporting me and helping me with things that I need and my daughter. Because um, I've just not got any strength whatsoever. And he's not here at the moment. So I can't tell you what it smells like. Um, so sorry guys. I'm sure it'll smell really nice because normally birch brotch birch box products are really good so i'm gonna have to leave that for now sorry uh the shower scrub um what's in it for me treat your body to a new lease of life with this exfoliating treat it is infused with uplifting orange and jasmine flower extracts that linger on your skin and sweet almond oil to nourish and prevent dryness plus it gently scrubs away dull dead skin cells with fragments of gritty walnut shells i love the way they do these descriptions because they sound so lush and nice um but not all products actually work as they say they would i thought so it's sealed off so um i can't smell that either and i can't see um what kind of particles are in there to do the scrub either so I will be intrigued to see how well that works as well. Uh, I've got the Lumine Invisible. Now I've got the vitamin C of this. Uh, Birchbox sent that through to me uh, in one of their boxes and I love it. I must admit I am using it a lot. Um, Invisible Illumination Instant Glow Beauty Serum in Medium. Um, probably gonna have to add a bit of my own foundation into that because it's probably going to be too light for summer winter i think that's pretty good color well done birchbox scandi living is all about keeping things simple and the same goes for their beauty routine infused with pure arctic spring water this lightweight serum hydrates brightens and evens your complexion for that coveted glow use it alone or under makeup just give it a shake then apply all over your face cool cheers look forward to trying that out and the mana kadar um long wear powder ready to throw out the makeup rule books this multi-purpose powder can be used on cheeks and eyes to add a pop of color wherever you need it formulated with a lightweight texture it glides on smoothly to deliver a healthy flush to cheeks or pretty definition to eyes it's really sparkly you probably wouldn't be able to see that um with the camera because it's um shining back at you um but yeah i look forward to using that i think i'll probably put it on my cheeks um because i can't see me adding that to my eyes it make my eyes probably look um, a bit like i've been hit um and i'm not adding a lot to my eyes these days because my sjogren's um doesn't really allow it I, um my eyes are dry as it is and i have to put eye drops in so i don't tend to use a lot of um eye makeup um sadly and i've got loads and i do love using them when i can um and i do for special nights out but my mascaras uh, again 
they kind of clog up because I don't produce enough tears and um, moisture in my eyes to to be able to wash away all the dirt and grit that go goes into my eyes which these guys do put into your eyes so yeah that's a good birch box again well done and you get 25% off um, your booking when you use the code birchbox for urban adventures your next stay they always put something like this in which is always nice really but anyway um that's this month's birch box and i hope you guys who get birch box as well enjoy the pics that they sent you um i'm still loving it i uh, hope you are bye hi everybody um just jumped on here because i just received my emma hardy um holiday heroes uh it comes in a really cute little box and uh inside all the products were in there which i've taken them out um because i couldn't wait sorry um but in there you get the moringa cleansing balm which i already use and it smells divine basically um but it it actually does do a nice cleanse but also leaves your face feeling a bit um less dehydrated after you cleanse depending on what you use um i normally actually use also elizabeth arden's uh, ceramide replenishing cleansing oil which is very similar to emma hardy's moringa cleansing balm um it's so easy just one squirt put it over your face then dampen it after you've put it on um, and leave it just for a little bit and then rinse it off and it's done and seriously it leaves your face feeling fresh um, moisturized and nice um, so yeah so in the box there was this moringa balm which I happen to love anyway um, it was recommended to use um, her professional cleaning cloths with the Moringa Balm, which I'm intrigued to find out and, and to do because I haven't used um, that before. Uh, so I thought that that would be quite good to, to see if there's a, a difference, if you really do need to use her face cloth or not. Um, I don't know, um, but it came in the pack. So I thought I'll give it a go. Um, I'll open it up actually, because I think a lot of people are always intrigued when they get face cloths because um, I got one through my birch box that you just dampen and then you can clean your makeup off um, and this one is dual action and does the same thing basically you can use it to wipe your makeup off without anything um, or you can use it with a moringa balm which is what I'm intrigued to find out um, and yep it is too f that I would assume is that side is for wiping it off with just water um, and that is like a muslin very nice um, texture um, but look at the size of that it cover my face anyway um, so yeah hands up I think that's quite good and you even get a little thing um, to hang it up if you have in your bathroom something to hang up so it can dry and it doesn't get all mucky after you've rinsed it out um so yep yeah. and what else we got the balancing facial oil um i love facial oil especially in summer um because your face gets dried out i have quite a few actually um facial oils which i happen to love i actually have the siskin uh the night and day one rose and neroli day facial oil um i don't use it every day uh because i just don't feel my face actually needs that much oil on it every day um but say once a week or so especially if you're having a no makeup day um just throw on some facial oil let it soak in let it do its magic um this one actually is nearly finished so that would be great to use um the night one is actually lemon and sea buckthorn brightening night oil um which i love as well oh, it smells so nice when you put it on at night 
Um, the third I the fourth item actually, because that's um, the Amazing Face Hydra body oil, which um, I do use body oils. I have quite a few. It smells divine. I love products that actually smell like you're in a spa or being in a spa. So I'm looking forward to using that. Probably lasts me. Probably lasts me a few weeks application every day or a month at least maybe. Um, it's not not a bad size. And then also Emma Hardy's amazing face protect and prime. I'm intrigued to find out how well this primes actually, but I love the fact that it's an SPF 30, which means that I can actually put my moisture cream then over this, um, knowing that my face is protected as well. So um, yeah, I, I, I love that. I love the, the fact that it will be protected. Um, a daily to cleanse skin can be used alone or on top of a uh, usual skin cream for added protection um so yeah cool uh cheers emma harvey so looking forward to that i will let you know how i get on with those um and see how we go it's hot today uh the football will be on later on and i'm already sweating out so it'll probably be a no makeup day again today uh, a, lo a lot of my products are just cream cream protection after sun um and more moisture and cream anyway have a good day and speak to you soon bye morning um i bought a new hairbrush um because with this humidity i wanted to try out a different style of hairbrush um so I've been watching this other lady on uh, YouTube on um, how to style sleek um, while you blow dry and that's what got me thinking. So I invested in this uh, Tangle Teaser Get Your Yay Hair Blow Styling Smoothing Tool Wet to Dry. Um, that's the hairbrush. Um, it's quite big actually. Uh, it's bigger than I thought it would be. Um, it's, it's a paddle, semi paddle brush as such. Um, and it has the painted technology, I assume it's painted tip, um, for tangle tees, the, the, the dip on, on inside, which stops your hair from tearing and stuff. Anyway, this claim to make it sleek and smooth whilst you dry your hair, quick drying, frizz free, smooth results with volume and shine. Um, it's a half size for short to medium hair. Um, I would class mine about medium. Um, and all you do is whilst you're blow drying your hair, you brush your hair as well. So that's all I've done, um, which um, surprisingly took less time than it would normally when I blow dry my hair and then once I finish blow drying my hair my hair normally is all over the shot so I've got to put some more products on and to tame it down again um, but today I'm reasonably impressed actually because it's not all over the place this is without any products in and, and my hair feels sleeker it does actually feel sleeker <laughs> to be fair um, and smoother and that's before adding any products in so I think by the time I've added my normal styling products that I like to use and I always like to finish off with a finishing spray or an oil of some sort especially with this dry heat at the moment and of course your protection um, spray as well because of the sun it can also damage your hair uh, the heat um, it's quite hot at the moment so anyway I thought I'd bob on here to let you know that I have tried this tangle tease blow styling smoothing tool um, and I would give it a thumbs up because I do believe it actually works considering my hair is pretty frizzy 
most of the time but even more so recently with this dry weather and stuff and I don't know if you can see it there but it isn't too bad it's not all over the shot like it would normally and I also feel having dried my hair using this that I think it'll stay like this for longer um, compared to using other products then it feels a bit gunky and so forth so thumbs up for the tangle teaser smoothing uh, styling brush and way to go great invention I uh, hope you all guys have a good day I've got to go put my makeup on um, and get on with things bye